here I did the curly hair method. I didn't do an intense workout, but still my muscles are so sore. I love you so <laughs> Crazy. I didn't see this coming. I had no idea. Oh my god. <laughs> Because tomorrow um, we planned on going to Stradbrook Island. We have arrived on Stradbrook Island. Now you can see that it's a head. Oh. Good morning. It's pretty early. It's something like six. Yeah, 6.30. I just got up and I didn't sleep that well. I wasn't really able to sleep um, or to fall asleep yesterday uh, because <laughs> we went out on Saturday and on Sunday I slept until 2 p.m. So I was like, okay, maybe I won't be able to fall asleep tonight. And this actually happened. Um, so I didn't sleep that much, but I still decided to get up early because I'm meeting friends in half an hour um, we will meet downstairs and I wanted to go to the gym after that and I did something to my to my hair I did the curly hair method and now I'm really excited how this will look so I wanted to open this now okay I'm really excited and I hope I have nice curls let's see Ooh. okay I like this time I always try to use some hair from the front and the back um, because then the, the curls are more, I don't know, they just get better and it doesn't look weird. Okay, ooh, I think it's even. Oh, my hair is a little bit wet, okay. Okay, I think I have to brush my hair. Yes, I like, I think, I think I like this. I used some bigger strains this time to have bigger curls. And I think I prefer this. Yes, I will make breakfast now. Um, jump into my sports clothes and then I will go downstairs to meet my friends. Two things. Um, I started to buy these your things. Um, we always call them quetchies. <laughs> I don't know. And it's so fun to to eat this. Um, Cause yeah, I don't know. It's just like a drink. Uh, but today I'm putting it on my on my yogurt. Um, There's something I wanted to tell you because it's I don't know. We always had this for breakfast on the road trip, and it's just fun. It's it's a perfect product. Seriously, I'm a fan. Um, and if you're on the go, you can just have this for breakfast without needing any cutlery. Perfect. Um, and I'm in my second phase for a grapefruit, um, which is why I'm eating this this morning. And I really like grapefruit. I don't know. I think I didn't like it when I started to eat it, but now I'm, I'm really a fan. Mm. So good and this is a good grapefruit and i often have grapefruit before having breakfast just for vitamin c um yeah 
now I will continue preparing my breakfast. And the sun looks really nice actually. I can show you it's um, reflecting in the in the windows and it looks really beautiful. Wow. I like this view. It's office buildings, but I don't know. It it is beautiful. I'm having breakfast now. It's porridge with protein powder, yogurt, and I started to eat uh, peanut butter in the morning again. And this really makes a difference for me um, because otherwise I would be hungry by 10 or 11. Um, and if I have peanut butter in the morning, I'm full much, much longer. And I don't get hungry um, that fast. Um, yes, and it's really good to have healthy fats in the, mo in the morning. So this is something I implemented and I really like it. And I wanted to say something else. Ah, now I know. Um, I wanted to go to the gym after meeting my girls, but my muscles are really sore. So I was thinking about what to do in the gym. Maybe we'll just do an ab workout. Or maybe when I'm there, I will, I will see how bad it is. But I don't know, I haven't been to the gym for quite a while. And the first time I tried to I don't know, I didn't do an intense workout, but still my muscles are so sore. Crazy, but that's good, that's that's a good sign. I am ready now, I put my gym clothes on, uh, packed my things, now we will have a girls talk. Um, yeah, sometimes that's, that's needed, oh, I still, <laughs> I didn't blend in my um, concealer. Um, yes, and then I will go to the um, gym at university. Okay, a little update. Um, my girls didn't have some kind of emergency. It was it was my parents. My parents surprised me, and <laughs> I could still cry. You saw my um, reaction. It was it was crazy. I don't know. We were just we we're just sitting there, and then I turned around, and suddenly my parents are there. I'm I'm still very overwhelmed. I didn't know that they were coming. Um, they just told me they were flying to Singapore and had some nice days in Singapore and told me that they would go to Bali after this. Um, yes, and suddenly <laughs> they're in Australia. It's crazy. I'm really happy that they're here. Um, I was I was missing them. I yeah. I, I, maybe I was a little bit homesick last week, um, and I'm so happy that. We will spend some days here, have a good time together. Um, they will stay for two weeks, so we have a lot of time. Um, and I'm, I'm so happy right now. I'm still speechless. <laughs> I don't know what to say. I was just <laughs> crying. <laughs> but I'm really, really happy because um, now they can see like where I live. Um, they can meet my friends here. We can travel Australia together. Um, so that's that's really nice. And now they're in my in my room. Um, resting a little bit um they wanted to sleep because they're tired um they flew overnight um yeah and i'm on my way i was on my way to the gym so i will do my workout now as i told you <sighs> crazy i didn't see this coming i had no idea and my friends here organized everything um the two two girls here um I don't know, they, they text it with, with my parents, it's, it's crazy. And one of the friends is going to Tasmania. We were thinking about going together, but um, after knowing that my parents would come, she didn't ask me <laughs> and uh, didn't tell me that she already booked a flight and is flying tomorrow. Um, so, I don't know, I'm a bit overwhelmed and um, I'm so thankful for them and my parents and they, I don't know, that they organize everything and surprised me like that. I was, <laughs> it was, it was crazy, <laughs> but I'm so happy that they're here.
Marcus. Um, I just met Marcus and Andras in the in the gym. I told them that my parents are here, and apparently everyone knew except me. <laughs> um, and they planned some some trips without me, so I can have some time here. Um, feels amazing. I didn't. I had no idea. I'm back from the gym. I had a really nice workout today. I did legs and abs. The muscles were still pretty sore from two days ago, but it was still a really good workout. And now I'm back home. My parents are still sleeping and I decided to cook something for us so that we can have lunch. It's 1 p.m. now. Um, and I still had all the things for curry. So here's the rice. Um, I'm making curry now and I'm also making a salad. But I have one problem because I bought um, coconut milk, but I would need an opener for this one. So I will just look for, I don't know, a knife and stab it in. <laughs> um, yeah. Okay, lunch is ready. I made curry. I don't have a lot of dishes, so <laughs> I just try to find... Um, yes, so this is all I got. And here is a salad and this is uh, the breakfast maybe for dessert. Yep. Hi, hello. Hi. <laughs> yes, it's an English vlog. <laughs> <laughs> um, we just had lunch, now we're at the hotel, or no, I don't know, so, uh, yeah, we're checking into the apartment and my parents are on the 53rd floor, um, and I'm really, I don't know, we will see how the, how the view is up there, but it looks really nice here, and after this we will explore Brisbane. Wow, <gasps> this, is, this looks really, really nice. Oh. oh my god! <laughs> That's amazing! Wow, I've never seen Brisbane from from that perspective. Amazing! Um, <laughs> yeah, we were just talking about that. Most hotels don't have a balcony or a window to open, just to be sure, you know. Um, but the last one in Singapore apparently had one. We're having dinner now. We're at some <laughs> at a Chinese restaurant, and um, Dad and I are having uh, fried rice noodles. And you have something with rice and pork. Yes, guys. I can tell you, I'm still very overwhelmed, and I don't know. I. I still didn't realize what happened today. Um, that was a crazy day. My parents are in Australia. What the fuck? <laughs> I never thought that they would visit me. No, I had no idea. And don't even yesterday when I knew that my that my parents um, would fly to Bali and suddenly, I don't know, Caroline had some kind of problem and I was like, okay, let's discuss this in the morning. And I was like, okay, could we do this earlier so I can go to the gym after this? At no point I thought about, I don't know, getting surprised by them. Crazy. I'm so happy and we had a really nice day. I don't know, every time I'm with my parents, I'm just, it, it just feels like home. I can't, I can't describe it, but I'm a different kind of relaxed as soon as I'm spending time with them. And this is so nice and I'm really happy that um, we get to spend two weeks in Australia together now. Happily, I don't have anything planned um, because it's literally the perfect timing. I don't know, the last week I was feeling really weird and my mom was also like, when um, when we faced him the last time, you looked really sad. And I was like, yes, I was a little bit sad. Um, I don't know if I was homesick, maybe a little bit, but I was definitely missing home and my family. And I don't know, I just felt weird. So this is the perfect timing. And all of my friends knew that they were coming. So we don't have any trips planned, or at least I don't have any trips planned. And um, some friends are leaving, um, but that's, 
I don't know, it just, it makes sense because now I have a lot of time to spend with my family and we already discussed what we're going to do um, the next days. I will start to um, get ready for bed because tomorrow um, we planned on going to Stradbrook Island. This is an island um, pretty close to Brisbane and I haven't been there so far. It's supposed to be really nice and a lot of friends already went um, so we're doing this together. Um, a little day trip to Stradbrook Island and the weather is really nice the next two weeks. Everything was kind of supposed to be because originally my parents really wanted to go to Bali but the flight got cancelled and some kind of appointment my mom had got cancelled as well so they were like okay now we have two weeks we can also go to Australia and, su and surprise me and yeah that's what they did and I don't know it just makes sense and I have time to travel with them the next um, for the next two weeks I have one assignment due next this week no next week so at some point I have to do this I don't really know when I'll do this but I don't know I would just put the least effort into this one um, because I don't know I just want to have a good time with my family and the assignment is definitely not my highest priority the next two weeks. Um, yeah, so this is our plan. We will go to Stratbrook Island tomorrow. I showed them at Brisbane today. They really like the city. We have perfect weather the next two weeks and we, I don't know, planned a little bit. We want to go to the Sunshine Coast. We want to go to the Gold Coast, Byron Bay, and they're flying home from Melbourne. So we will rent a car on Thursday. Today is Monday, oh, we have a lot of time, I'm looking forward. Um, and then we want to do the East Coast and we thought about flying to um, the Uluru. Maybe we'll do this. This is, um, yeah, those were the things we were talking about. But yeah, I'm so, so happy. I don't know, I could, I could cry again. <laughs> I'm so happy that they're here. It's just really important for me that my parents know, I don't know, where I live, what I did here, um, who are my friends. I just, I don't know, I'm really, I'm really happy that we get to share this experience. Yeah. <sighs> this, I don't know. <laughs> it's just so crazy that I had no idea. How can I be so naive? <laughs> But I don't know. I'm so happy. Yeah. And I will get ready for bed and sleep because I didn't get a lot of sleep last night. And we will leave early tomorrow. And I'm really looking forward to spend the day with them. And I will take you along tomorrow. Um, yeah. <sighs> I still need time to process this. Good morning. I just got up and and got ready. Where's my... I'm looking for my bag. Got it. Um, it's something like 7.10. Um, I just got up and got ready because we're going to Stratty today. Um, so we're going to Stratbrook Island. Um, I've never been there since since being here and it's a it's an island really close to Brisbane. Um, to get there by public transportation is not that easy actually. It takes about three hours. But we will do a day trip um, to, to Stratty. And I will pack my things now. It will be a nice beach day. We want to explore the, the island. I didn't sleep well. Um, I couldn't fall asleep because there is some kind of construction work and it's pretty loud. And it's like a constant noise that you don't realize in the beginning, but after some time it's get, it gets really annoying. And I actually slept with, um, with AirPods and only after I was really tired, I put them out. So maybe this is my approach for the next days. But I will pack my things now to go to Stratty. I'm really looking forward. I'm looking forward to see my parents again. Um, they live pretty close to here, which is nice. And we wanted to get bagels close to the bus stop. Um, for breakfast. Yes, that's fun. The light is fading fast from this old town. We gotta go. Ooh, let's have a look. Wow. I didn't. Hey. Wow. This is something with Avo, how Australians would say. And I have something, I needed to get this one because it's with truffle, truffle mayo or something. Yes. 
we got our breakfast, we got bagels, and I had one of the best matcha lattes of my life. We went to O Bagels, which was really a really, really good store. Um, then we missed the first bus. I should not be in charge of, um, of directions, but now we made it to the train station and our train leaves in a minute. We have arrived on Stradbrook Island. It's insanely beautiful. I just showed you the view. We are on some kind of lookout here, um, and it looks amazing. I always love how present my mom is because she's really observing everything, and I never um, see such things. Um, but it's good to have her with us today, so we see um, a lot more than I normally would. We found kangaroos, and it's the first time seeing kangaroos for my parents. And tomorrow they will go to the sanctuary, so. Um, there you can also touch them but now we can see them here in Asia which is really nice we are doing the trails now here are a lot of trails near the beach where you can see the, the cliffs and we already saw kangaroos I showed you and my mom is on the hunt my mom wants to see koala bears um, and I haven't seen them in, in nature so I'd also really like to see them but oh here's another kangaroo another one and those are the trails and you have really nice views and the weather is perfect actually Can you see that? It's a mother. Show us your baby, please. Oh, you can see that. Do you see that? Ooh. I've never seen that before. I thought you would see the, the head, but you can only see a leg. That's weird. Now you can see that. It's a head. Hi, a sunset. You don't get to see sunsets often um, on the east coast, but today we have one. Yay! I think this is Morton Island. We've been there on a camping trip um, and also had a nice sunset there. We just got back. I had a hot shower because it's getting cold in Brisbane. I don't like that and we're even going south this week which means that it'll be even colder <sighs> okay I'm ready for this um, and we went to the supermarket to get some things and I will have dinner now and I bought really nice nice stuff I got oh my god I don't know the name what is it baby rocket oh I didn't know that baby rocket um, is this hot I don't know um, Mozzarella, mozzarella see <laughs> and this was literally the only mozzarella you could buy fresh buffalo mozzarella but this is a really nice one it was my only choice and i really wanted to have uh, mozzarella tonight um raspberries <laughs> i'm always so happy this is the best way to eat a yogurt and this one is also really good, it's vanilla. Then um, I told my parents that they have to try Tim Tams and there was a special deal if you buy two, um, two Tim Tams. So this is what we had to do. Um, Navi yogurt, this is one of the best. This is Greek, Greek style yogurt with probiotics and vanilla. Really good, big recommendation. I will only buy yogurt like this from now on. I don't care that it's more expensive. Um, and I think that's, yeah, that's all I bought and I wanted to do a salad with Baby Rocket, new vocabulary learned, perfect, um, tomatoes, mozzarella 
I think I still have tofu. That's my plan. God. I'm not sure if this is seriously um, buffalo mozzarella. It looks like burrata. Do you say that in German as well? Probably burrata. Yes. Um, because this is too this is too soft in the in the middle. Let me have a look. I'm not sure. I feel like those are pretty similar, right? Uh, this looks amazing. So I made a salad. This looks really nice and it is mozzarella. Um, yeah, I tried it and I still had some rice and tofu so I made rice and tofu with soy sauce and peanut butter. Um, yeah, and I'm really looking forward to eat this now. Okay, boys and girls, I'm ready for bed and I'm already really tired. Um, there is some kind of construction work in front of my window, but it's pretty close and I can hear that Why I could not fall asleep yesterday and the day before that so I It is quiet today Maybe they're done that would be great um, because I don't know I just started two days ago, you know, it's a constant noise and at some point I don't know it gets really annoying, but I spent some time with uh, my friends uh, in the last hour, two hours, uh, because one friend is leaving for Tasmania tomorrow, and it was really nice to see her again. And I just watched um, the WhatsApp story from my parents, which is always, I don't know, which is always really cute. And now it's time for bed. Um, I really hope that you enjoyed the vlog. Um, the vlog didn't turn out as expected. Um, obviously, I didn't know my parents were coming. Um, but yeah, I'm really, I'm really happy that they're here. And I've been re-watching the video of them arriving or them surprising me over and over again. So if you haven't seen the video, please go to my Instagram channel um and check the video out it is really emotional and a lot of people texted me that they started crying as well which is really cute um and i can relate because every time i watch the video i could cry again yeah <laughs> but we had a really nice day today um stradbrook island is beautiful and i'm really looking forward to show them australia and spend some nice days with them and I will take you along. So I really hope that you enjoyed this vlog. Um, make sure to subscribe my channel. Um, yes, leave a comment if you like. I always love to read your comments. Um, yeah, I would say that's it for me. And I want an emoji. Um, I think the best fitting one is the one where two people are hugging. Um, because I feel like this is, I don't know. My parents are here and that was everything I needed um, and I needed a hug from them. So if you've watched the vlog until now, please leave the, the emoji where two people are hugging. This is really wholesome. Um, yeah, so that's it. See you in the next video and have a nice day. Goodbye.